We have Misty helping Dr. Gonzo. Hi, Misty. Hey. Now, Misty, why don't you go ahead and pull that skin back a little bit and hold that right there. Oh, we've got a really good shot of this. Hey, Dr. Gonzo, how are you today? I am awesome. Good, good. Dr. Fair. That's All what she right. called. Dr. what? Fair. Fair. That's beautiful or pretty? That's ugly. That's ugly. Oh, really? <laughs> Oh, do I do the cold spray? Dr. Gilmore's going to do the cold spray. Dr. Gonzo's going to inject the stalk of the skin tag at the left axilla. Are we ready? Are we doing it on the mole or right under it? You're going to go at the stalk right underneath it, right between the mole. Well, it's a skin tag, not a mole. Right between the skin tag and the skin. So pull up on it. Pretend it's like a tick, and <gasps> you'll be injecting the head of the tick. Ready for the cold spray? Yes. Are we already? What size needle are you using, Dr.? I am using 27 and a half. Okay, stop. Yep, that is cold spray. Burr, give her a little shot. There we go. Squirt it in there. Stick, sting, oh, yeah. and they burn. Dr. Gilmore says stick, sting, and a burn. No, Gonza says stick, sting, and a burn. Yeah, doctor I'm right the now. assistant this time. You okay? Did you squirt it all in? Yeah. Well, then you can withdraw hair. the needle. Right How was that? Did that hurt much? No. Was the cold spray cold? No. Really? It was, it was cold, cold on my hand. hand. Yeah, she's just being obstinate. All right, now what you're going to do I'm is grasp blood. firmly the, the skin tag and lift and make a cut at the bottom. Really? Just snip it off. Go. Ow! That didn't hurt. <laughs> there. You have to get back. Have Put it close to the skin to see it. She cut it off. Okay, there we go. Now you're going to put a stitch in. Now I'm ready standing by with my gloves on just in case. Okay. Did you I'm give us permission sure. to record this for the... Uh, no, dinner? I didn't. Yes, you asked. I did. I know. I thought I did. I thought I did. Okay. How long have you had this little skin tag? Forever. Forever? Damn. Wow. Did you name it? No. Well, that's not any good. Are you happy to have it off? Hell yeah. I'm sorry. Yes. <laughs> now it's gone. Now you have Dr. Gonzo needs to put one stitch. Okay, so how do Don't you... stick yourself. Is this the first time she's doing a stitch? Yes. Oh, goodness gracious. I tried to get her to practice on a potato, and you know what she said? The, she uh, said, Scarlet's like a potato. <gasps> oh. She knows that. She called you Scarlet Papas. Scarlet Papas. Which means Scarlet Potato. Mm-hmm. Okay, there you go, little so right here? Yes, perfect. A little bit wider. Okay, that's, that's fine. Go ahead right there. And then go through the other side. Ignore that giant armpit hair. Good work. Did you get through both sides? I think I did. It's Just hard pull for me off to see the hair. way back here. Hmm? Just pull the hair off. It's it's okay. Mm -hmm. Did you get it? Did you get it deep enough? We will find out. We will find out when you try to suture that up. There you go. And then it. Just do two loop, loopity loop twice. This, and like. This. That's pretty good. And grab it and pull it through. Don't stick Scarlet in the eye with She's the needle. She's about to. I know. I am not about to. Okay. Do a little dab on that. Let's see how you did. That's not bad. Make it a little bit tighter, maybe. A little tighter. Okay. Now do uh, this time. Do just a single loop. Did you get it? No. You want me to do it? Yes. You sure? Yes. Because you Go were ahead. doing a good job. Go it ahead. didn't tie it up. You did do a good job. Do it again. Mm. Scarlet. <laughs> Scarlet has so much confidence in me. You get a sticker and a band-aid. Just leave this alone. We'll take that stitch out in a couple of few days for you. Okay. Say this is money. We'll take it out on Friday. Okay. Okay. Put a bandage on there. Good work, little Gonzo. Misty, thanks for your help. Scarlet, thanks for letting us record the removal of your pal. Gracias, doctor. Absolutely. Bye now. Bye. Okay, so we have our patient Scarlett this morning doing our next day wound check. Wow, that looks fantastic. I'm going to try to get in real close. It's just nice and clean. You had a good doctor. Dr. Gonzo did a nice job for you. Thank you for the coffee, but I got my own. You got your own coffee? Yes. Yeah. How come there's a big G on there? It doesn't mean Gonzo. Yes, it does. Ha! Oh, you guys are out of control. So a few people have asked me about Meta7, is it really made in the United States? Well, dang right it is, and most supplements are not made in the USA. This was formulated by Dr. Gilmore. You know him from Texas. You've been watching his channel. And you're a subscriber. Then it was put together in Georgia. 
on a facility in the United States that's GMP certified. You want to look for that. Um, there's a lot of supplements out there that are coming in from China and they're trash. They're not good. They don't deliver what they promise. The percentages aren't what they say on the bottle. This is the real stuff and you're getting high quality stuff made in the USA. It's checked, certified, and tested. Everything is exactly what it what it's supposed to be. So again, formulated by Dr. Gilmore to give you seven quality ingredients that'll boost your metabolism, make you feel better. You won't have that drowsy feeling in the afternoon. You won't have the jitters of caffeine. And made in the USA, vegan, non-GMO, GMP certified. It's good for you. Go ahead and order today. But yeah, it's the real stuff, folks. And the ingredients are top level. Mm -hmm.